it's Stephanie. Happy New Year. I hope you guys are having an awesome start of the year. Today I'm here to do a haul, a clothing haul. I haven't done a haul in a while, so I'm super excited to show you guys some of the things that I've picked up recently. And most of these things I got with like some Christmas money that I got. So I just wanted to show you guys some of the things that I recently picked up and I really hope you guys enjoy this video so let's just get on into what I got. So starting off with JCPenney since I've had this stuff for a while I uh, got two things from JCPenney and I've been look I'd been looking for fur vests for a while and then one day I just went to JCPenney and they had these um, super cool fur vests and they were really inexpensive and they were a really cool style that I hadn't seen before. So the first one is this one and it kind of looks like a little um, fuzzy mat, like the ones that you put on the floor. But I thought it was really different and cool and I really like the shape cutout that it has since it has like this little like circle type cutout thing. I thought it had a really cool shape compared to other vests that I've seen in different color too. So I decided to pick this vest up and I know I got it on a really good deal. It's by the brand, um, I never know how to say this but it's like the JCPenney brand that starts with an O. I think you guys know what I'm talking about. I really like it and then I also got another vest. So the second vest that I got is this black vest and it was also different from vests that I've seen. It's a little longer than the other one, um, but it's very like chic and like classy and I really liked the look of it. The front part is like this um, fake fur and then the back is, um, it's different, it's not fur, it's like, um, like a little cardigan material. So I really like the look of this too and I really like wearing it because it's kind of like, gives kind of more of like a fancy look and I don't know, I like the look to look chic. <laughs> so yeah, those two things I got from JCPenney. The next store is Sephora since there's a Sephora and JCPenney. Um, so the first thing that I got is a new beauty blender because my old beauty blender was so messed up, like it's not even funny. Um, Pilachina actually like bit off half of it so I was like still using it like I cleaned it and I still continued to use it because they're kind of pricey and um, but I just bought another one because I really like this to apply my foundation with and I've just found that it's it looks the best compared to using other things so I got the red beauty blender and I'm pretty excited to use a new beauty blender to go along with my beauty blender I also bought this mineral water and um, you have to wet the beauty blender to be able to use it you have to like get it wet so um, I wanted to try out this water so if I'm like on the go or something I can just like spray it on my beauty blender and then I'll be able to use it or I can just keep it in my room instead of having to go to the bathroom like every morning when I get ready for school like I have to like be rushing and I like run to the bathroom and like wet my beauty blender and get it ready but with this I hope that I will just be able to do everything quicker so I really hope this works and then the last thing that I got from Sephora is a new Clarisonic brush head because um, I haven't used my Clarisonic in such a long time because I haven't bought any more of the brush heads but I was like you know what I have Christmas money why not just spend it on a new Clarisonic brush head and this is the acne cleansing one and I've been having a few breakouts so I decided to get this one, but that was everything that I got from Sephora. The next place that I have stuff from is American Eagle, and I have a huge bag, but um, the first thing that I got at American Eagle is this huge coat, and I probably won't be able to get it all on the camera, but it's just like this huge, like, pea coat type coat. I really like the... It's kind of like a cross between a one of those like coats that like cinches in. I don't know what those are called, and a, like a pea coat because it's like the pea coat material. And I know that these get a lot of lint on them, but I just really liked it, and it's like this navy blue color. But um, it was on a really good deal, and I needed a new coat, so I was like, why not get it? Plus, it has like this super furry um, hood. So yeah, I just got this and I got it on sale for like 
um, I think it was like $51 on sale. But originally, I, it was like a hundred something, so I thought it was a really good deal. And um, I just needed a new coat, so um, I got this coat from American Eagle. And then I also got this super cute cardigan. I'm really excited for this cardigan. It's like a super long cardigan, and it's like this um, soft sweater wool material I don't know what it's called but it's a super soft material and it's like super long like it's really long it's like um below my ankles or like my ankle length but um I really just thought it would be so nice for those like cold mornings when I have to go to school and I can just like put this on with like a cute shirt or something um, and like some jeans and some boots or like some ankle boots or something. I don't know, but I thought it looked Cute and I also got this on a really good deal too because when I saw the price tag it said like it says $69 and I was like, yeah, I'm not gonna buy this but then when I like checked it on the um, when the lady checked the price for me um, she, said, she said it was $20 and I was like, yeah, I'm gonna buy this. So um, yeah, I got this cardigan, which I'm super excited to wear. And then the last thing that I got from American Eagle was this shirt. And I don't have anything this color. It's like a mustard tan color. And I don't have anything that's this actual color. So I was like, um, let me pick this up because I really like the little design right here. It's like, it reminds me of something like off of Free People. I don't know. But I was like, I really like this. So I think I could even wear this with like a black skirt and then this shirt. Um, I just think it would be really cute. And I got it for like $10. And it says right here uh, that the original price was $30. So I think that was a really good price. So I'm really excited to wear this shirt. But that was everything that I got from American Eagle. Um, the next place that I went to was Target. And, um, well, this isn't in order. None of this is in order. But I'm just, like, picking stuff up from my floor of all these things that I got. But this is some um, makeup items. And these are, like, my most used makeup items. And I just needed to, like, pick some up. But I wanted to um, just show you guys and tell you guys, like, some of the makeup items that I used just in case you guys are wondering and if you guys would like to see an everyday makeup routine then definitely comment down below um, I think it'd be really cool to show you guys um, my makeup routine what I usually do for my makeup so um, the first product that I got is this elf clear brow and lash mascara and if you guys have been watching me for a while you guys know that I love this stuff um, it's just really inexpensive it's like a dollar um, it just like sets my eyebrows and sometimes I use the um, clear mascara to just like separate out my eyelashes because I don't really like using regular mascara but I really like this and it's only a dollar so yeah I got this and then I got the wet and wild ultimate brow kit and this is what I use for my eyebrows I really like the little um, brush on here that is for your eyebrows um and i just like use it to fill in my eyebrows i just like mix these two colors and i like outline my eyebrows and then i like fill them in but um yeah this is what i use for my eyebrows and then i got the maybelline instant age rewind under eye concealer and i really like this and i had ran out for like a while and I finally got to repurchase it but um, I really like this for under eye because um, I like how the brush feels like under my eyes but yeah this is really good and it's really good at brightening your um, just making you look more awake and stuff so I really like this and I got a new one of these and then I got the um, what is this? the Maybelline matte poreless foundation the Maybelline fit me matte poreless foundation and I really like this foundation it's so inexpensive so if you guys are looking for a new foundation definitely check this one out because I really like it and it's also really inexpensive so yeah the next thing that I got is the Maybelline fit me concealer and this is like my favorite concealer probably but I just use this on like um spots on my face if I want to like cover anything else up and I really like this and I hadn't bought it in a while so I'm really happy that I got a new one. And the last thing that I got is these, 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 
this um, NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil and I've been watching a lot of makeup tutorials and a lot of people just like put this on their lid to like make their eyeshadow colors pop so you just like put it on so like the other colors can like stand out on your um, eyeshadow so it can like pop more since this is like a white base so I decided to try it out since I want to like do more stuff with my um, eyeshadow <laughs> But yeah, that is everything that I got from Target. The next place that I have stuff is from Charlotte Russe. So the first thing that I got from Charlotte Russe were these shoes and um, what? They're so cute. I don't have um, any shoes with this like little lace thing right here. And I've been seeing it a lot like this. A trend with like the lacy shoes I don't know what that's called but um, I really like these shoes and they were like $25 but um, I just really like I'm so excited to wear these and I know I can wear these with like jeans and stuff I actually already wore these and I wore them with like some black jeans but um, I'm just excited to keep on wearing these more but yeah um, definitely check out Charlotte Roos for shoes because they have a lot of cute shoes like every time that I go in there like I just like go to the shoes like eventually and just like look at all the shoes because they have awesome shoes and they're not even expensive like my Harry Styles shoes like I wear them a lot and these I know I'm probably gonna wear them a lot too but um yeah I got these from Charlotte Russe and then the last thing that I got from Charlotte Russe is this dry shampoo and this is in the scent um cherry and um I don't know I just saw it and I was like let me try it out because my hair sometimes gets super oily and sometimes I don't even have time to like shower in the morning and so you just gotta like you know spray some and just like go but yeah I got this dry shampoo from Charlotte Russe but that is everything that I got from Charlotte Russe so the last two places that I have stuff from are Bath and Body Works and Forever 21 so I'll start with what should I start with? I don't even know. Hmm. I'll start with Forever 21. Okay. So, um, okay. So these things I already wore, but, um, I wore these on New Year's Eve and I really loved this outfit together. But if you guys saw my vlog, I vlogged and I also vlogged on New Year's Eve actually. But if you guys saw my vlog, this is the outfit that I went to go buy when I went to the mall with Elizabeth. This was my New Year's Eve outfit and I'm probably gonna wear this again to like a party or something. But um, it's this black skirt and it's like a lace type design skirt but it also has like all these little like sparkly sequins on it and I was like yup this looks like New Year's Eve so I was like let me buy this and it's a really good length it's not like too short or anything it's I really like the length on this but yeah I got this from Forever 21 and then the top that I wore with it is this sparkly green top and it's kind of like off the shoulder a little bit but I really loved this outfit together like these two things together I was like oh my gosh but um I really like this top and I'm excited to wear this outfit again I think this was like 10 something or like 13 or something so it wasn't expensive or anything I'm just like obsessed with this and I can't wait to wear it again yeah that is what I got um I have another bag from Forever 21 but that was my first bag and then my second bag because I went twice to Forever 21. The next thing that I got is this makeup bag and it looks like holographic or something. What is this? I think it's like holographic. I just saw this makeup bag and I was like, it looks super cool. So let me get this because sometimes I'm running late for school and when I'm running, running late for school, I like put all my makeup in my book bag and I like do my makeup on the bus because sometimes i just don't wake up right away and i'm like running late for school so i was like this will be better that i just put my makeup in here and stuff i should probably do a, a video on how i do my makeup on the bus probably i don't know how i would do that video but um yeah uh if you're ever running late for school just like take your makeup on the bus or something but um yeah so i got this makeup bag and then the next thing that i got from forever 21 was this belt and this is a just regular 
a brown belt. It got like stuck on this thing. Ah. Okay, so it was just a regular brown belt and um, I really like wearing this with a jean shirt that I have around my waist and then like a dress. I really like how it looks with like a belt. I had another belt but it kind of like got old and stuff so I got this belt from Forever 21 and I'm really excited to wear it with my jean shirt and dresses. And the next thing that I got from Forever 21 was these earrings and I only, I usually only wear um, like little stud earrings or like smaller earrings like right now I'm wearing these earrings and I also got these from Forever 21 but um, I only prefer to wear these like smaller type earrings and these are all gold and they also came with like these two little like um, ear cuff things so I'm pretty excited to like, I don't know, try these out and see if I look cool or anything. <laughs> but um, yeah, I got to these from Forever 21. Then the next thing that I got, oh, were also these earrings and I really like these earrings. I think they look so cool, but they're just like these like little triangle type earrings. So I'm really excited to wear these too. And these are like 390. And then the next thing that I got was this top and this is like a crop top and I really like this little cross that it has right here like it has this little like um cross thing so it like shows a little bit of skin if you're wearing like jeans or like a skirt with this it just shows like a little bit right there but um i really liked this and it was only 12.90 so that was super good and i actually bought this to go along with a skirt that i found too and this was like on sale so I love this skirt so much. I don't know if you guys can see, but it kind of like reminded me of like free people or something, like the little beads and stuff and like the design. So I'm really excited to wear these together. Like I'll probably wear these like during the summer or when it starts getting um, a little bit fresher and stuff because it's been really cold here in Georgia which is so weird because like ever since new year's eve it's been so cold and like the days before that like even on christmas like you could wear like short sleeve shirt and like some shorts because it was not even cold but on new year's eve it got super cold so i'll probably wear this like i don't know like april or something but i just really like those items and they were on sale so i was like let me get these why not but then um i got these tights and these tights i'm probably gonna wear like during this time but these are just some like dark gray little tights and i love wearing tights with skirts so i'm really excited for those and then the last thing from forever 21 is i just got these clips and stuff to like um put on my hair for when I don't for when I like straighten my hair and I don't want to use like a hair tie because then it'll like clump my hair I don't know if you guys know what I'm talking about but it'll like leave the little mark on my hair so I got some clips that was everything that I got from Forever 20 the last thing that I got were some things from Bath and Body Works and I got these things yesterday when I went to the mall with David Ooh, if you guys don't know who David is I will put a link down below to a video and it'll explain to you guys but for those of you guys who do know who David is then let me know down below if you guys would like to see a video with David I've really been wanting to do one so you guys can like get to know who David is so um, I'd really love to do that video so if you guys want to see that then leave me a comment down below please so I only got um, a couple things from for or from Bath and Body Works. So the first thing that I got, everything was like on sale. They were having like their huge sale and it was like a lot of good deals. I was like, whoa, if I hadn't gotten some things from Bath and Body Works for Christmas, then I probably would have bought more stuff because it was a lot of stuff that was on sale. So the first thing that I got is this coconut lime breeze um air things. What are, these, what are these called? Wallflowers. What, what, I couldn't remember what they were called. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited to start smelling like tropical stuff. So I got these to put in my wallflowers since I don't like burn candles or anything in my room. I don't know, maybe one day in the future I'll do it. But for now, I don't burn candles in my room because I'd probably burn up my room that's not good so the next thing that I got or the last things thing that I got from um, Bath and Body Works are hand sanitizers this is my first time buying this type of hand sanitizer because the last time that I got my own hand sanitizer they were still with the little um, 
shape that looks like this. And so this is my first time getting these. I don't know why it reminds me of like a little trash can or something. That's probably bad, but um, they're still cute. They're really cute. So the scents that I got are winter raspberry pink Fioni, I think that's how you say it, Raspberry Pink Fioni, I think. And this hand sanitizer reminds me of my friend Jayla. Um, she used to go to my school last year, so Jayla, if you're watching this video, I love you so much. <laughs> it's kind of weird to have this reminds me of her because she used to have this hand sanitizer and she would always let me use it because I'm always like asking people for hand sanitizer. Like, my hand sanitizer game is not a joke. Like, I don't know, I'm just like that person who needs hand sanitizer, but... Yeah, fun fact of the day. Well, you guys probably already knew that, but. The next hand sanitizer that I got is Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte. And I don't know, I just wanted to get this one even though fall already passed. And the next scent that I got is Ocean. And I'm probably gonna give this to David because he really liked this scent. So I'll probably give it to him when we go back to school together because he's gonna go to my school again now and it's gonna be so exciting. And then the last one that I got is Sweet Pea. And this was the first scent that I ever got um, when I went to Bath and Body Works. Like the first time ever that I went to Bath and Body Works, I remember that I got a hand sanitizer that was Sweet Pea and then the lotion. I just remember that, but yeah, it smells good. So that was everything that I got in this haul. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, then please give it a like for me. And also, be sure to comment down below any video requests that you guys may have at all. It doesn't matter. It could be challenge videos, videos with my cousin, videos with Benji, videos with anyone. Well, Probably not every anyone, but um, just any videos that you guys want to see because I want to film so much. It's kind of hard with school and stuff, but I want to do more like talking videos because those aren't as hard to film as like um, other videos, more like edited videos. So I really want to film more. I just really want to film more, but school. But I will try my best. So please leave me a comment down below of any challenge video or any type of video, a video that you guys would like to see with David or just like anything. I am really excited to film more videos. So um, thank you guys so much for watching my video. I love you guys so much, so, so much. So like my love for you guys is so huge and I'm just, just blows my mind that you guys watch my videos and support me like any who's watching right now thank you so much for wanting to watch my video but um yeah so that was everything for today's video i really hope you guys enjoyed it and i will see you guys in my next video shout out to mickey if you guys see him in my videos i haven't filmed in this location in a while but um let's get back to it but yeah shout out to my boy mickey who always sits patiently in the back of all my videos but yeah so um again uh, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys in my next video. Adios. My foot is falling asleep because I'm, I was like sitting on my foot on my chair so that I could like be taller on the frame, but it's just like killing me. Like, I think my foot is dead now. Bath and Body Works because so I coconut cocoa. Who doesn't love time? The struggle of taking a thumbnail picture. You guys should definitely go check out this tune. So good. It's by my friend. You guys have to go check this out. I'll put the link in the description box below. Oh, I'm getting a phone call. I love you so much. Quisiera regresar el tiempo y cambiar errores. Sé que todo fue mi culpa y te causé dolores.